Okay, boys, in this video, we're going to be doing uh, just how we divide decimals by multiples of tens. Pretty simple unit, um, but we just need to make sure that we understand the concept of this because it's not always uh, as simple in regards to this question here. So, we need to think back to when we did uh, multiplication by decimals. Okay, so if we had uh, 9.76 and we multipl multiplied it by 100, meaning we made it bigger, Remember, all we had to do was count how many zeros or how many decimal places it needed to move and then just moved it to the right. So, for example, if we times this by 100, there's two zeros in that, we just moved the decimal place two spots to the right. So, our answer was 976. Okay, now if we did this and we're doing division, we just got basically going the opposite way. So, instead of going to the right here, we're just going to go to the left. So, make this number smaller. So if we had 9.76 divided by 100, we would just move the decimal places uh, two to the left. So one, two, and we put the decimal place here, and all you need to do is fill in those empty spaces with the zero. So 9.76 divided by 100 simply equals uh, 0.0976, okay? Now what happens, and that's, it's quite simple, but what happens if instead of a one, so see if I can rub this out, we have a uh, four. So what if it's uh, 9.76 divided by 400? Well, we sit, basically do the same process, and we just need to break down this number into two different parts. So effectively, 9.76 is the same as 9.76 divided by four, then divided by 100. Okay, so we basically just separated this into two other separate um, division equations. So all you need to do when you get a question like this, whether it's 9.76 divided by 400, all you do is break it down into two parts. So I can effectively do 9.76 divided by four, which we'll do now. So 9.76 divided by four, 4 goes into 9 twice, which makes it 8, 1 left over, bring the 7 down. 4 goes into 7 um, 4 times, so it's 4, 8, 12, 16. Remember, I put my decimal place up. 1 time, bring the 6 down. 4 goes into 16 4 times. Okay, so I now have my 2.44. I'll bring this down here. 2.44. And then at the end, all I need to do is make sure I do this again. I divide it again by 100. So remember, when we divide by 100, we move 2 to the left. 1, 2, and there's my answer there. Point. So here, my answer is 0 0.0244. So that's how you divide a decimal by a multiple of 10. Remember, it's easy when you just have a, a 10, 100,000, you move it that many zeros to the left. If it has a, a whole number in front of it, for example, 400, 500, etc., break it into two separate parts, and then you can do it uh, in two steps as you go through. So that's how you divide decimals by multiples. Next, we're going to be looking at how you divide decimals by decimals. Thanks, boys.